Hey there, mortgage professionals. This is Christina Talkington, Head of Compliance for My Mortgage Trainer. And today we want to walk you through accessing your NMLS account to view and navigate your education record. The first step is to log into your NMLS account. Visit the NMLS Resource Center, which we will link to in the comment section, and then click on the Login to the NMLS button located at the top right hand corner of the screen. When you land on the login page, use your NMLS provided username and password to access your account. On the left hand side of the page, you will see a drop down menu with the heading You Are Currently. You will see two options in this drop down menu federal and state. Please make sure that you have selected state. Then click the MLO Testing and Education tab located at the top right hand corner of the screen. You will see your name and NMLS ID number within a box. At the bottom of the box, there will be a hyperlink labeled Your Course Completion Record. Click this hyperlink and a new tab with your most current education record will open. Continuing education will appear on top. All CE requirements will be under bluish gray headings. You will see your federal CE requirements for the year we are currently in first. If you have completed all your federal education, you will see a green compliant check mark in the CE total column. If you have any deficiencies, these will show with a yellow triangle with a red exclamation point in the middle. If you scroll below federal CE requirements, you will see your state CE requirements for the current year. As with federal CE, if you have completed your education for the year, you will see the green compliant check mark. If you have not completed your state CE for the year, you will see what you are deficient in, which means you will still need to complete state specific CE for that state this year. Directly below the current year state CE requirements, you will see a list of courses that you have taken in the current year as well. If you scroll below the federal and state CE requirements for the current year, you will see your education records from all the previous years you have been licensed in as well. That covers continuing education, but you also view your pre-licensing education record on this page. To view your PE record, scroll all the way down past your current and past continuing education requirements. You will see a green line that divides CE from PE. All pre-licensing education will be shown under green headings. We hope that you found this quick tutorial useful and are willing to show us some love by giving this video a quick like and subscribing to our YouTube channel. If you're feeling extra generous, give us a follow on Facebook and join our Mortgage Professionals group to stay in tune with industry tips and updates. And bonus, you stay connected to future Compliance Corner videos with me.